Welcome back people my people to best Aussie booze news and reviews and today you're looking at the cocktail that I should have made last week but screwed it up and even today I am not sticking to the recipe from Hill Martin because I have a major problem with um, egg whites. Basically 12 years ago I nearly checked out and the brilliance that you are now watching would never have happened because I had salmonella so I don't touch raw eggs. So I'm sorry to Hill Martin in but no raw eggs in this one. What I am making is the Scarlet Lady cocktail, and I promise to God I will do it properly this time around. So, the initial ingredients, apart from the ice that you can see there, is, I will take it, is 45 mils. Yeah, that's a shot. So, sound of happiness. A shot of their wonderful gin. Their Pinot Noir gin, which, if you watched last week's Misadventures, or even this week's, I made it for when I'm posting this, I actually turned into a gin sour and then a gin sour fizz. So a shot of that. It says 22 mils of Cointreau. Now, I don't speak French. What I do is speak Belgrave. So I'm using the Tiki Zest from Killick Distillery in Belgrave. Knowing I told you there would be a reason why to like Belgrave eventually. So we're going to hear another sound of happiness. I love corks. I'm going to pour half a shot of the Tiki Zest, which actually enables me to drain the last of the uh, Pinot Noir gin into my glass. There we are. Purely Melbourne made and bubble Australian made products. Even lemon I'm about to use is Australian made because it comes out of my backyard in Melbourne southeast. So I'm going to put the cork back into that. Now it says 22 mils of fresh lemon juice. Let's see how much half a lemon holds. Well, this indoor rock climbing I do, gardening I do, comes to good use eventually. Now, the Tiki Zest from Killer Distillery is taking, as I've said, the place of Cointreau. Why drink French imported stuff when you've got perfectly good Australian stuff available? Pretty well, in my case, almost on my doorstep. So I'm going to now give this a stir. Make all those tinkling sounds and pray that I won't break my glass. And the third plug, the glass is brought to you by Organic Bay. Makers Iron Gin. Mind you, Hill Martin makes it. Hill Martin, sorry, not Hill Martin. Hill Martin makes some stunning gins. If you don't believe that, go and watch the rest of my channel. They have unhappiness. Putting the cork back in this baby. So... Due to the power of off camera, I'm going to have a try of this. Oh, people, if you love your citrus, this just took to citrus with a slow jammer. The tiki zest is made from, I think, mandarins that were left over. Um, yeah. It just says citrus, so it's a tiki zest. There's a good squeeze of lemon juice into this. And we've got the Pinot Noir gin. So this is the Scarlet Lady cocktail, because it's kind of like Scarlet, you can see. And I'm Odin, and you've just hit that subscribe button. And I will see if I can find another cocktail to make with this absolutely delicious Pinot Noir gin from Hill Martin in Plenty. Tiki zest is in Belgrave, up in the hills. Organic Bay is um, Bayside, Seaford, and I'm Odin, you're not, but what you are is my newest subscriber. Thank you people, my people.